come on, give me something here. Hello survivors and welcome to We Who Survive. My name is James and today we are going to start our assault on Vault 95. Um, I'm not 100% sure how well that will go so we'll have to see about that. How do I have all this stuff favorited? Okay so we do still have ammo for the Mosin. Not much. It's my inspect button. Okay, so I think what, yeah, we got seven rounds for this. Yeah, we got seven rounds for this. We have nine rounds for the 7.62. So that'll be for the scoped assault rifle. Uh, trying to think what I'd like to walk in with explosive wise, probably a frag mine would not be a bad idea. Um, that's tough to say. I think, I mean, for now, we'll start with the frag mine. We'll hold on to that. We'll be armed with the Mosin, and uh, we are just going to get it cracking. So I'm not even going to cut the elevator here or anything. We are just going to do this all in one beautiful shot, because if I manage to do it, I don't want there to be any question that I did it. I am not that confident, if you can tell, but... Oh, God. All right. So, I don't want to have my flashlight on, because... I don't know if someone's going to be right... No, I guess they won't be right here because of the traps. Okay. Do, do, do. Oh, man. It's going down. Maybe we should keep these traps up for our own safety right now. Oh, someone took Barry Mentats again. Look at that. Okay. Well, I don't want to accidentally set these off. So we're going to... Okay, people. I think it really begins now. I think the first strategy is to do nothing. Let's see how much they'll clear each other out before we even get bothered with this. Barry Mentats is sort of saving our life right now. We didn't even take it. Oh, that could be extremely useful. Holy crap. Dang, we don't need a new grease gun. We need ammo for our current grease gun. Oh, okay. 
All right, I'm going to drop one stability save here in case of a crash, because this is probably about the safest I'm going to be in this adventure. Um, now I guess I got to get pushing a little bit. I have no idea how that missed. Come on, give me something here.
Oh. Okay. Interesting. Level right in the middle of this. Oh. Okay, you know what? We're gonna take Intimidation. It's not gonna do a lot of work for us at level four, but when it works, that's gonna be huge. That will be utterly game-changing. Okay, I am going, uh, going to drop another stability save at this point. And now we will press on I feel like this bottom is where I need to be focused on right this second. I know the food's down here. Oh, I think I got that dude. Okay, but that's just one. There's potentially a lot of MFers down here. Oh, nice. Oh my god, yes, we got 308 ammo. Oh, boys and girls. Ooh, we even got a little ammo back for our... I can't think of the name of the weapon. My grease gun, because I am tweaking. Alright, there's going to be a lot of good armor down here to come back and loot, potentially. Alright, so back in there is where you want to be careful. There's like this... Uh, this mine of sorts. And there is a lot of live people there. No way. Give me that cramp. Yes, look at all this stuff. This is why I wanted to come back. Okay, so back there is potentially where there's a lot of big issues. Whoa, pristine? Holy cow. Holy cow, holy cow. I think we're going to trade guns, boys and girls. I think we are going to trade guns. Uh, what's ours do here? Oh, yeah, all day, all day. All right, here, you can have this. Holy cr Oh, it uses 10 mil ammo. Well, that is interesting and oddly, strangely, sort of perfect. Because we've had 10 mil ammo and no way to use it. Okay. Well, that works out absolutely lovely. Um, we'll cook up that food. Cook up a few waters here. If I can have them. Can I have this? Okay, I guess... What? Bro, that's so dirty. Oh my god, dude. They're not gonna let me have two of these waters. Well, then I don't need these two. Okay, so... Mother... Alright, but we are gonna attempt to cook some cram. Right here. What? Did I not grab the cram? Oh, do I not have wood? I have no wood. I thought that's why I had magazines and stuff. All right, well, let me take a look at this situation real quick. Junk. Wow, yeah, we really, uh... That's plastic. Okay, don't need you. Plastic. Okay, so... There's a bit of a workaround there on the magazines, I guess, that it's no longer wood. But that's okay. So, there's got to be some wood around here somewhere. Not that I want to focus on that. We have to focus on clearing... Um, but it would be nice to have our next meal ready because I do not believe we actually have any more cram. Okay, back here I've never ventured. That looks like a long wraparound to this mine part. Okay, um... I guess, let me see how long I've been recording. I think we are going to call that part one of Vault 95, so... There's potentially two ways to go. We can go back there and see what that hot mess is, or we can go up there and see what that hot mess is. I think there's less people up top here, um, and they're more loosely organized, like they're not in groups as opposed to over here. But either way, it's not going to be easy. So we'll see what I get up to, because I'm literally about to instantly go and record that now. So I hope you enjoyed part one of Vault 95, really part two, I guess. I have no idea how that went so much better than the first time. I also feel like there was 10 times less people. Um, but yeah, so we're going to wrap this one up here. And then when I come back, we are going to finish off what we started, ladies and gentlemen. So thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. My name is James, and I will see you in the next one.